Water towers, those big things are often the first thing you notice driving into any Oklahoma community, most usually spelling out proudly the town's name in big letters. But Galen Culver tells us how one municipality did something extra for their new water tank, and they got some big recognition. Of all the improvements that have taken place to Hugo, Oklahoma's water treatment over the past two years, this one is the most obvious. A half million gallon tank towering over the city, lit up at night and almost fully functional. <laughs> Through the upgrade. Water Department Director Albert McLean has watched progress on this hill closer than just about anyone. Over the past two years, he's been charged with keeping the system running, even as the old tower went out. It was all new to me, but educated. <laughs> There's water in the tower. City manager Leah Savage kept watch too from her office at City Hall. Right. Of course the whole thing took longer and proved more expensive. It was one of those things that needed to be done. But towards the end she got a perk from the company that installed it. They asked for color schemes and design ideas. Everybody does black letters. Savage got to work right away with a pen and sketch pad. She thought an all black tower might look good. But of course with the water you don't want to make a tower black. In the end she came up with a white tower with black and gold highlights, Hugo school colors and a buffalo head mascot at the center. And I love it. It's very bold. The finished product looked pretty good. Good feedback. So good, the Tenement Company nominated it along with 320 other towers for an award they call Tank of the Year. We're excited about that. Among those chosen from all over the United States, Hugo's made the top 12 and runner-up to the eventual champion, which went to a dum-dum theme in Bryan, Ohio. It is one of those, for sure, honorable distinctions that we're so happy to be a part of. Hugo has another tower in line for replacement in coming years, maybe marking another chance for an award that really holds water. In Hugo, Galen Culver, News 4. Is this a great state or what? And all 12 finalists for Tank of the Year will be featured in a top tank calendar <laughs> for 2024. No word yet on which month Hugo will get. I think my favorite water towers are in Bartlesville, Oklahoma. They have yeah. three, hot, warm, cold. They have they have two of those in, uh, is it Chicota, Mike? Okima has, Okima. has yeah. that, yeah, yeah. Nice. on the north side of I-40. Right. Heather, you're a wealth of information. <laughs> Thank you very much. And that was a riveting story about water towers, too. That was yeah. so much fun. Top mm -hmm. tank, not tank top. The, top tank yeah. calendar. They yeah. didn't get their own you, calendar. You know, you could do tank tops on a day like this too, right? Yes. It's like pretty warm. Outside. Not too bad.